第五十五页阅读测验，进入摇摆舞的节奏吧。Get into the rhythm of swing dancing. Though there is no father of swing dancing, one man stands out both at its beginning and again with its rebirth. Born in Florida in 1914, Frankie Manning was an ordinary child. His mother was a dancer and encouraged him to try dancing, but she didn't think he would ever become a dancer because he was too stiff. Manning wanted to please his mother, so in their new home in Harlem, New York City, he practiced endlessly and eventually became an excellent swing dancer. He even had a hand in creating a new style called the Lindy Hop. In 1935. He joined Whitey's Lindy Hoppers, the premier swing dance group of its time, and began to choreograph dances. After World War II, the era of swing came to an end, and Manning hung up his dancing shoes and took a job at the post office. In 1986, Manning was asked to teach young dancers the Lindy Hop. At age 75. Manning co-choreographed the Broadway musical *Black and Blue*, for which he received a 1989 Tony Award. He was even invited to Sweden in 1987 to teach at a dance camp. He returned there every year afterwards until his death in 2009 at the age of 94. Today, with more and more swing dance groups and festivals set up, swing dancing has regained popularity around the world. Characterized by its many lifts, spins, and flips, swing dancing is an ideal pastime that brings vigor into the lives of many. However, if you find it hard to keep up with the fast dance steps, you can still have a great time watching people dance while listening to the lively music.